this is another fun activity that you can use to get to know each other and just to have some fun and build some group cohesion in your group. And this is what we call bubble basketball. And it's one of our favorite activities that we do. So you can start by having your group divided into two teams. You could even do three teams if you wanted to. Um, but you want to get them divided into teams. And then what you're going to do is you're going to want to lay down some tape that kind of, that's your start line. Because this is going to be kind of a relay and a competition. So I'm going to lay that Pull it out a little bit and lay it right on the ground. Okay, so that's our starting point. So what next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna get a trash can or a really large bowl and you're gonna to wanna to put that several feet away from your starting line. Okay? And then each team gets one package of bubbles. So here's Catherine will be a team and I will be a team. So what the goal of bubble basketball is, just like it sounds, is to try and get um, bubbles blown into your basket, which is going to be your trash can. So on the start of go, when you say go, each team is going to, one person would blow the bubbles and the other team members would work on after the initial bubble is blown, continuing to blow them until you get one in the trash can. And it sounds pretty easy, but it can be kind of tricky because bubbles don't necessarily move the way we think they're going to move. So, you ready, Catherine? Uh -huh. Okay, here we go. Your mark and set, go. And now when you're doing this with a team, people can work together. Oh, oh that's good. So to blow it, you blow should start back at the that. line before you blow any more. Okay. So blow one, blow from the line. Okay. Oopsie, oh. I didn't get any. And then pick a bubble and See if you can get it in the basket. Oh, 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 oh my god, it's <laughs> And you can imagine when you have about 20 people doing this together, it is a great way to get everybody just interacting, they're laughing. We often have people do this um, when we're teaching a big workshop um, as we're getting you know everybody in the door and stuff, they just sort of join up or we'll put them in teams when we start and it just is a great way to get people, they really have a good time. We're having fun just the two of us this week. And you can keep points and really call ah, it. Got one. <laughs> when someone gets one in there. Oh, 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 oh. oh missed that one. You can get a lot of strategy going on. Yeah, you'll actually get when you do this with teams of people just on their own, people will naturally just start taking charge. Um, you know, kind of the leaders in the group will sort of emerge, and people will get real creative with how they will do this. So it's, it really works out well. 